All right, what's up everyone? Welcome to the Surfside PPC YouTube channel. Today I'm gonna to be going over how to steal traffic from your competitors. So a simple method that you can use to actually get more traffic back to your website by trying to rank for the same keywords that your competitors do. Now this isn't the only way to get traffic from your competitors, but it's one way to find websites that are very similar to yours and try to rank for the same keywords that they're ranking for. So I'm gonna start with two websites open. First is gonna be alexa.com and the other one is gonna be similarweb.com. So we're gonna be using their free searches here. And what I'm gonna be doing is entering my website into both. Okay, so similar web, I enter beachfrontdecor.com and it's gonna start searching. We're gonna come over to Alexa and what we're gonna do is we're gonna to scroll to the bottom and you're gonna see browse top sites here and we're gonna do the same thing here. So beachfrontdecor.com, click on find. So when you do a search like this, just the free version of Alexa will automatically pull up some of your top competitors here. So you can see four different competitors that it thinks websites that are very similar to mine. Now it's gonna be the same thing if we come over here to similar web. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna to scroll to the bottom. So they're gonna give you a lot of different information here. I'm gonna scroll all the way to the bottom here and you're gonna see competitors and similar sites. And then it's gonna say similarity and rank. So a couple of the ones here are ourboathouse.com and then beachdecorshop.com. Same thing with Alexa over here. You'll see ourboathouse.com, beachdecorshop.com. Alexa is saying the closest website to mine is beachdecorshop.com. Now, if you don't have websites that are coming up here, if you don't have enough keywords that are already ranked in Google, if you're not getting a lot of traffic to your website yet, one thing you might wanna do is just take websites that are similar to your content, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna come over here to the Google Keyword Planner first. So you open up your Google Ads account, we're gonna click on Tools here, and we're gonna come over under Planning to the Keyword Planner. So now what we have is we have the Keyword Planner open, and I'm also gonna open Uber Suggest here as well. So what I'm gonna do in both of these search engines is I'm gonna enter beachdecorshop.com. So in Uber Suggest, we have it here. We're just gonna enter it there and click on search. You can see right here at the top, new feature, type in a competitor's domain to get better keyword ideas. So that's basically exactly what we're doing. We're gonna click on search here. We're gonna come over to the keyword planner as well and we're gonna do discover new keywords. And then rather than starting with keywords, we're gonna start with the website and we're gonna do the same thing here. So beachdecorshop.com. We're gonna use the entire website and click on get results. So in the keyword planner, what it's gonna do is it's gonna pull up their top keywords by relevance, and then it will also pull up keywords with average monthly searches. So we can click here if we're looking for keywords with the most average monthly searches that are relevant to our competitor website. Otherwise, what we can do is look at keyword by relevance. And what we can see right here is beachy end tables, beachy accent tables, beach house end tables. So all these different types of keywords, they're already ranking very high for. So these are keywords that Google and specifically the keyword planner thinks are the most relevant to our competitor website. So you can see there's a lot of different options here. And as we scroll down, there's even more options. So you'll see beach themed clocks, beach themed table lamps, beach bar chairs. So you can already see we can get a ton of different content ideas for our own website. So again, we're doing this for beachfrontdecor.com. So it's a very similar website to beachdecorshop.com. And basically what we're trying to do is find some of the keywords that our competitor is ranking for, some of the keywords that are most relevant to our competitor website, so we can try to rank for those keywords as well. So if we keep scrolling down, you can see clocks and end tables are both really popular keywords for this website. And if you keep scrolling down, you'll see other things as well. So lamps, beach home signs, you can just see something even flip flop wall art. So you can get a bunch of different long tail keyword ideas here as well, just by entering a competitor keyword website into the Google Keyword Planner. Now, if we come over to Uber Suggest, we're gonna get a lot of different ideas as well. So you can see they have 22,000 organic keywords, which is a lot. If we keep scrolling down, we can see some of their top pages. So homepage, bath accessories, nautical lamps, surfboard decor, beach clocks. So all of these are some of their top pages. And you can see how many estimated visits they get for each of these pages, how many shares they're getting on each of these pages as well. Keep scrolling down, you can see some of the top keywords here as well. So just bathroom beach decor, crab decor, surfboard decor, beach wall clocks. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take some of those ideas and we're gonna start creating content on our own website. So what you can start to do is take some of these keywords here and start entering them into a list if you want to. Same thing with the Google Keyword Planner. Find some different keywords that you're not ranking for already. So if you just take something like beach house table lamps, beach style table lamps, we just take the short tail keyword of beach lamps and what we would try to do is create content around those keywords. So what I've done is I've taken some of these keywords here like coastal end tables and also beach wall clocks. So we've taken some ideas from the Google Keyword Planner, some ideas from Uber Suggest, and what I've done is I've gone on my own website and I've created content around those keywords. So you can see on beachfrontdecor.com here, 
100 plus coastal end tables and beach end tables. So I recently created this article. And the reason I found some of these keywords here and some keywords that I'm not ranking for already is because I used these methods before. So we've gone to alexa.com, we've gone to similarweb.com. You can enter any website here, any app that you want. Same with Alexa, enter a different website. You can use all these free features here. They also have paid options as well, but we're just using the free features. Take the websites that are your competitors, enter them into the keyword planner and into Uber Suggest. Find some of their top keywords, find some of their top pages, and go ahead and make some content on your own website like 100 plus coastal end tables and beach end tables. If I scroll down here, you can see I have a lot of different products for sale. So some large images here, some of my favorite ones. We keep scrolling down. There's over a hundred end tables listed here. Now the other thing I've done is same with beach wall clocks. So I've recently created this article as well. You can see 100 plus beach wall clocks and coastal wall clocks. So I just came in here, I entered some different content. I still wanna keep improving these pages, but it's just some different ways to find websites that are very similar to yours, some competitor websites. And this really works well if you have a more established website. So if you're trying to grow your traffic with an established website, this really works well. Otherwise, what you can do is just come over here to the Google Keyword Planner, go over to Uber Suggest, and enter some websites that are similar to yours, That websites that you're basically trying to emulate that they have some really good content already and you can see what they're already ranking for and then try to create content that's better than theirs. And whether it's something like this where you have a blog post that's listing a ton of different products for sale and giving some inspiration to someone who has a beach home or if it's something on the marketing side. So if I came over here to the Google Keyword Planner, I entered a marketing website similar to Surfside PPC, I found some of their top keywords, then what I can do is maybe create a YouTube video around some of those keywords, go onto my website and try to create some content around those keywords as well using my YouTube video so that I can rank higher and take some of their traffic and send it back to my own website. So a pretty simple method here, you just wanna enter your own website into these alexa.com and into similarweb.com and you'll find a ton of competitor websites and then you can find a lot of different keywords that maybe you're not ranking for already maybe you're not optimizing for yet and you can start to take some traffic from your competitors and send it back to your website so if you have any questions leave them in the comments section thanks for watching my video today and make sure you subscribe to the surfside ppc youtube channel